Hello everybody. Today I want to show you one of my favorite dishes, shrimp broccoli in garlic butter sauce. You will like it. Welcome back to my channel Carl's Kitchen. The shrimp broccoli dish is very quick to make and you need only broccoli around uh, one to two pounds. You need one pound of the shrimp and some spices. I'm gonna show you what we need for this dish. First is uh, our broccoli. Here's our spices where we marinate the shrimps. And here our shrimps, I guess it's around a little bit more than one pound. Then we need for our sauce the chicken stock, the honey, lemon or vinegar. We have behind our teriyaki sauce, the garlic with a little bit ginger and our soy sauce and oyster sauce. First we prepare our shrimps, so we add our spices. This is garlic powder, paprika, onion powder, Italian spices, salt, black pepper and tamarind powder. It gets a nice color. So we add everything over and mix it. I make it with a plastic bag because I don't have gloves. So our marinade shrimps are finished. I guess they look great, huh? And now we start to fry them. So we start to fry our shrimps. We heat up our wok and add a little bit olive oil and now we take care of the shrimps so that every shrimp have contact with the bottom I let them fry for around two to three minutes, one and a half minute each side. So we turn the front and the other side. Really nice. Don't cook them over or fry them over, they get a little bit rubbery. a little bit of an oil. Stop the fire for the moment. And we take the shrimps on the side. We want to have all the nice flavor of the shrimps. We add our broccoli. Give them one spoon more butter. 
And now we fry the broccoli about four to five minutes. Now we add the garlic. And you let it fry it at your own taste. Some like it very soft, some like it super soft, some like it crunchy, it's up to you. We add one more butter. So now the garlic gives its flavor to the butter. The butter gives the flavor to the broccoli. And now we add our soy sauce and our oyster sauce. The honey as well. The chicken stock. And now we let it cook for hmm, three or four minutes longer. We add a little bit from a fresh lemon. Now we add again our shrimp. Don't miss anything of this nice sauce and flavor. And heat them up. Give them around two minutes to heat up and cover up all the nice flavor. So we near finish. Look at that. 